Order, the uh, Honorable Government House Leader is seeking the floor. Mr. Speaker, uh, so that uh, the ministers, uh, after the minister's statements, the representative leaders may provide a response, and so that that can be done in accordance with the rules, practices, and traditions of this House, I would ask unanimous consent for the following motion. That notwithstanding any standing or special order or usual practices of the House, after statements by ministers today, the House resolved itself into Committee of the Whole to allow Phil Fontaine, National Chief of the Assembly of First Nations, Patrick Brazo, National Chief of the Congress of Aboriginal Peoples, Mary Simon, President of the Inuit Tapirit Kanatami, Clem Charche, President of the Métis National Council, and Beverly Jacobs, President of the Native Women's Association of Canada, to make a statement in response to the ministerial statement of apology to former students of the Indian Residential Schools, and that the Speaker be permitted to preside over Committee of the Whole. After these statements, the Chairman shall leave the Chair, and the House shall adjourn to the next sitting day. Thank you. Rising on that point of order. Mr. Speaker, on behalf of the official opposition, we are honored to consent. The Honourable Member for Joliet, on behalf of the Bloc Québécois, obviously we consent to this motion. The Honourable Member for Vancouver East. On behalf of the NDP, we most certainly give our consent. Is the unanimous consent? in this way. Agreed? Agreed and so ordered. Pursuant to order made on Tuesday, June 10, 2008, the House will now proceed to statements by ministers. The Right Honourable Prime Minister.